hey kid, it's me. And you are you, and thank you for watching me, uh, as always. I've got some exciting news. Actually, not news for all of you, because some of you have already found out. Those of you with a keen eye uh, have already seen, I've gotten some emails, uh, my name in the credits of an American TV show. I guess I can say it's an American TV show, but it was filmed in Japan, which is why I was involved. Uh, it's called I Survived a Japanese Game Show. It's on ABC Tuesday nights in uh, June and July, August, I guess, 2008. Uh, so if you're watching this in the future, um, sorry, the show is already over. Yeah, uh, you missed it. So if you're watching this in like 2010, it's, it's done. Sorry. But maybe you can find a, a DVD set. Uh, and oh, by the way, I hope you're enjoying your flying cars and great news about curing cancer uh, and world peace. That was great, 2010. It's gonna be a great year. Um, but anyway, back to 2008 uh, and the TV show, it's, uh, it's pretty good, I think. I mean, I've only seen one episode, uh, so I can't see. I just saw it from you know the production side. Uh, I had a relatively small part on the production, but I got to meet lots of cool, fun people, mostly from LA, which made me uh, very homesick. Uh, it was really cool, though, working with them. They're all fun, interesting people. Uh, and, you know, it made me kind of think, ah, oh, maybe I should go back work in American TV, but nah, I like Japan here. And uh, actually a lot of people hopefully will be turned on to uh, this country through either the videos uh, that I make or things like they're doing on American TV. There seems to be an infatuation with uh, Japan recently on American TV. And actually I think the most interesting thing about the I Survived a Japanese Game Show is that I think YouTube is pretty much to blame for it being made. Uh, it was videos from Japanese TV, I think people were uploading onto YouTube that became super uber popular, went viral, and then uh, you know, network people said, hey, you know, we should make a TV show like that because people seem to really like it here. Um, and I think that's cool how there's now a kind of interplay where things that become popular kind of on a almost democratic level on the internet then kind of make a jump into TV. Um, hint, hint, uh, me. Where is my show? Why have I not gotten the show yet? ABC, NBC, CBS. <laughs> anyway, um, I was not in the show. I mean, it's hard to believe that they wouldn't have uh, this sexy body on the screen. But uh, there is actually some cutting room floor video that will, will never make it to air except on the small screen. I thought I'd share it with you. Uh, it's, uh, it's my confessional from uh, I Survived a Japanese Game Show, you know, where, the, where they interview the people who are contestants on the show. Uh, and uh, well, without saying any more, I'll just let you have a gander. Uh, thanks for watching my stuff. Check out the show, I hope you enjoy it. If you don't, well, there's other channels, I suppose, you could look at. I would recommend it, but uh, thanks and enjoy. Well, I'm really excited to be here. <laughs> I mean, uh, uh, Two hundred fifty thousand dollars. That's exciting. It's uh, wow. Uh, yeah. No, I'm 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 really excited to be here. I'll be honest. I'm I'm here for the money. I'm a little bit worried about uh, first uh, tribal council because I guess you know I'll be on the chopping block. There, there's no tribal what? council, Kevin. There's no tribal council. There's no tribal council. No, no, there isn't. Oh, this this isn't Survivor. Ah, oh. No, it's not. Well, what reality show am I on? I survived a Japanese game show. Okay. okay, okay. Japan seems great so far. I'm excited. Uh, you know, there's uh, there's a lot more bamboo here than uh, I, I'm, I'm used to. Japan, actually, many people don't realize this, uh, it is made out of completely bamboo. Bamboo. Um, and they they put decorative plates on uh, on shelves and stuff, and that's cool. There's also a lacquer box. That's nice. Uh, lacquer boxes, of course, very Japanese, except that one I think maybe was made in China. And there's this plant, which is like, I haven't seen that plant before, I think, but I think I had a dentist who has a plant like that. So I don't know if it's a Japanese thing or maybe just a Japanese and dentist's thing. You know, um, the other roommates uh, haven't really seemed to notice me yet. Um, I, I 
I've been keeping a low profile, uh, trying to you know steer clear of any fights. In fact, I don't think they even know I'm in the house. I, I get the feeling sometimes that they don't even know that I'm there. I feel kind of, you know, neglected. But I mean, that's my strategy. My strategy is to stay below the radar, so far below the radar that people don't actually even know I'm in the house. Uh, and so far, you know, that, that's worked. Um, in fact, I think they leave the house without me sometimes uh, and go to the challenges. Um, so actually, you know, uh, the other contestants, they all seem great. They've all been very well demographically selected. Um, of course, there's the, the cute uh, girl and there's the angry dude. And I guess I would represent the uh, dorky nerd uh, demographic. Uh, and um, we usually get voted out pretty early on. Uh, but there's a chance they might see me as being non-threatening and keep me in the game till the end so that they can beat me in the last round uh, and get the money. I'm mostly excited that uh, the show will make me famous and so when I go to the mall uh, people will notice me more uh, or at all really would be cool. Uh, though it will make it more difficult for me to shoplift. Yeah, um, I'm, just, I'm just happy to be here. I'm just really excited to be here. I want the money. I really want the money. But I mean, but whatever happens, even if you know, it, it doesn't work out, it must work out. No, it really, it, it better work out.